Yo, what's good y'all? Welcome back to another video and a new series. Uh, I thought I'd do a new series on the channel today. I didn't really have an idea uh, what I wanted to do. We're going to do act roster. Uh, this is updated roster, by the way. Um, I didn't really have an idea. I wanted to do a series, but I thought you um, can't really start a new series from scratch from like day one. Because even though there are updated rosters... Um, It'll just be too much. So I'm thinking about doing a sim. Simming the league about 20 years is going to take a... Sim is going to take the longest to do because every time you complete a season or you sim a year, uh, it, it not dashboards, it uh, disconnects from the servers. So it's going to take a little while to do that. I want to... Like I said, what I think about doing doing 20 year sim and then... Because league's going to be totally different. It's not going to be... There's still going to be people you know in the league, like the young players now are going to be the older players then, but it's going to be interesting. I'm going to um, pick a random team, because it's not going to really matter what team I pick, and I'm going to relocate that team. And also, relocation is going to be on, so who knows, other teams might even relocate themselves. So what I'm going to do here, pick a random team. I don't really know what team I want to pick. Like I said, it really doesn't matter. Um, it really, I think it matters what type of division I want to play in and what type of kind of city I want to replace. I really don't know. And I don't even know what team I'm going to pick when I do end up relocating. That's going to be like later on in the uh, video. But still don't know if I want to be AFC, NFC. Let's relocate. Watch the football team. You know they should have the newer things in the game. That's probably gonna be a mad twenty two. I mean twenty three. Um yeah. We're gonna have to change our role to owner, financial mogul. Because the only reason we're doing owner is to change the location of where we're at. And then we're gonna switch to coach. So that doesn't matter. All this doesn't really matter right now. I always put this all the way up to have the most to, to what I understand, it just puts the most stars, superstars, extractors in the game. I don't think this stuff is really going to matter, but we'll put it on 12 minutes. I'm not actually, I mean 15 minutes. I'm not actually going to play in 15 minutes, but we're just going to put it on these. And yeah, we're going to put everything on auto for now. We'll switch it back after. Pop-ups off, auto progress on auto. All this stuff is going to be on auto. So hopefully they do... Uh, do it like that. Go to the league. We have the regular players that's usually on the team. Carson Wentz, uh, Terry McLaurin, the regular people. I'll try to name people, but I don't even know this team like that. I'm not even gonna lie to you. I really don't know this team like that. Uh, I'm. There's a few people that's probably still gonna be here if they don't make any like major changes with the team. Chase Young should still be here. Um. Whatever rookie that is still should be here. A few young players still should be here. But um, this sim might take an hour or two. So I'm going to do all this off cam. I'm just going to show you what I'm doing. We're going to go to advanced week, regular season, mid season, sim to playoffs, sim to Super Bowl, sim off season, sim to draft, or sim to. 10 years, this is what it is. I'm going to do this twice. This is, like I said, I kind of did this practice in a way. And uh, we will be back when we're in the 2031 season, technically. And we'll see what the team is looking like. We'll see what the league is looking like. And then we'll do it one more time. And then I'll do the relocation. Don't know what team will pick for the relocation. And then we'll basically... That relocation season will make like trades if we want to make trades. Try to get some picks. Try to work towards the draft and stuff like that. We'll try to do things like that. But um, for now, it's in 10 years. And I guess I will see you in 10 years. All right, we are back after 10 years of simming so far. And it didn't take that long. Kind of took like five minutes. A couple still disconnects. But um, let's look at the team. 10 years isn't that big of a difference, but see, new quarterback, new running back, Terry McLaurin is no longer here. We actually have a 
decent team, not gonna lie. After 10 years, it's pretty decent. Check how old this uh, quarterback is. 31, so he's been here quite a few. Um, Pretty good. Yeah, really good. Really good quarterback. Let's check if he got drafted here, actually. Yeah, he did. Played here his whole career. Had pretty decent seasons. Not really. His interception and... I don't know. Did he play all his games? You can't really tell, but... Judging on, like, the yards... It doesn't look like, especially this 2026 season. Look like he was injured for most of it. Just had a very, very down year. But, I mean... His quarterback is pretty decent. We could check if he won any awards. Nope, he was just a first-round pick. We got him, like, after that, that first year, really. And he's been here ever since. He hasn't really won anything. And I don't think we have won anything. I don't even think we had any winning seasons. I have a pretty decent running back here. We got him two years ago. Or maybe last year. Once again, pretty, pretty decent. Pretty decent. He's kind of a mixture of, like, uh, power and speed. Receivers, a 94 overall. Wide receiver. Pretty good. Quentin Blackman. Pretty good. Like, this team isn't good. Has a look at the defense. They got Miles Garrett. So they kind of replace Miles Garrett. I mean, this team is really doing pretty nice. I cannot lie about that. They're doing pretty good. Um, I guess we're going to send 10 more years, but before we do that, we're going to check, uh, the league history since then. So we're going to go all the way back to the 2021 season, I guess. Are we? Yeah. The Cardinals end up beating the Chiefs. Deja Watt actually got his Super Bowl ring and Super Bowl MVP. Patrick Holmes won the MVP that year. Um... Our teams have not won anything that year. Let's go on to the next year. It was Saints, Ravens, and Ravens ended up winning Lamar Jackson and getting a ring. Patrick Holmes another MVP. Uh, JJ Watt won Defensive Player of the Year that year. Okay. Not bad. Bronco, not Broncos, Bucks, and Steelers. Deontay Johnson ended up winning a Super Bowl MVP. Vikings quarterback Jimmy Mulligan. Mike McCarthy has a couple coach of the years. Aaron Donald won defensive player of the year. So far, we're not seeing our team in nothing. I'm kind of just going to go through. I'm going to stop just like telling you. You can read it yourself. I'm just going to look if we have any uh, awards. And it doesn't really look like we do. Chiefs end up getting back in another Super Bowl. Interesting. And they end up getting in another Super Bowl. This is crazy. I mean, Patrick Mahomes, at this point, might have three rings. Well, four, actually. Three or four, I don't know. I'm losing count already. I forgot what I even just said. Still, let's go back to win another one. Make a fix Patrick this time. Trey Lance won the MVP. Still nothing, bro. Not a Super Bowl appearance, nothing. Jets actually gotten a Super Bowl. But he ended up losing. Still no awards for us, which is very disappointing. And last year, Bengals won the Super Bowl. And still no awards for us. I guess we're going to sim another 10. And see what that does. Um... I'm going to show you how literally long it takes to just sim a year, and you're going to see a dashboard. I'm going to show you a dashboard you want, and that's it. That's what I'm going to do. So we're down here at the end of the um, season. Usually here, around here, like the end of the playoffs, it usually disconnects, and I'm going to go back to the menu... Sign back into EA, go back in, and do it all over again. Sometimes it lets you do multiple seasons. Like, sometimes it might let you do two or three at a time. 
like without disconnecting but usually it is a disconnect and that is the annoying part see if like i said it is disconnect so i gotta go like this go right back in go all the way back sign back in Go into the franchise menu. As you will see, I have multiple franchises I just did like myself. I don't remember this Cowboys one. Oh yeah, I was trying to do like a a linebacker career, I think. Packers, Elks, that's some team I relocated. Salt Lake Elks, something like that. Uh this is the online one that y'all see me upload last week. Two games. I might get back to that. I was going to get back to that today, but, you know, some things came up. Couldn't really do that. Um, yeah, we just got to go back in there, and then when we do that, it's going to resume the 10-year sim. But it's going to keep on disconnecting. It, wow, it, like, immediately disconnected. That never happened to me before. What the hell? That's really never happened. But anyways, I'll just I'll come back when we're at year 20. All right, everything stopped. It made me retire. I guess you want to do like 15 years or so with a um, owner. So I think I picked a new owner. Did I? Can I go back? You go to retire. Got to create a new one, create a new character. All progress will be lost. Sure, whatever. As you see, the league is pretty balanced for the most part. I mean, the Saints are pretty bad at their overall. But there's a whole bunch of new players, a whole bunch of good new players. I'm going to go back to the Washington football team. And we're going to choose them again. Change role. We're going to be a – we can't be an owner? Why? Why is it locked? Is that how it is? I really can't be an owner? I can't be an owner. Why? That is super weird. What year are we in? 2041. So I guess technically we are where we need to be. But I really can't relocate like I wanted to. That, that was my whole thing. That I, I did it for. I want to get to this point and relocate. But I can't relocate. I'm going to have to figure out a way to try to relocate. I'm going to have to retire again. Choose a new one. Let's try this. Okay, now I could choose an owner. So I'm going to have to choose a different team. Um, I guess I'll take the worst team. I mean, in my head, this is what I was really going to do. Actually, they're kind of bad. Titans are kind of bad at uh, 79. But we'll keep looking. The worst we see is like 80 or 70. 79, I mean. I was hoping the team would be really bad, though. Saints seem like the real worst ones, though. Wasn't there a 70 something overall team? Oh, yeah, Lions. I mean, technically, yeah. Uh, we'll choose the Lions. And we'll change our role. We'll be our owner. Financial mogul. We're going to start the process of relocating. All right. But let's look at the team. Because we are going to trade people and we are going to get. Obviously, picks back and things of that nature. So, was this, what's his name? Matt Johnson. Pretty old. 36 years old. Still 93 overall, though. Pretty old. Still got good stats, though. Uh, we'll check how you played the past couple years. I mean, you have been a baller, honestly. Really? Nah, he's been pretty good his whole career. And he played here his whole career, too. Any awards? He was picked third in 2026. Uh, Nine-time Pro Bowler. Best quarterback. Offensive Rookie of the Year. He won an MVP in 2028. Offensive best. That's two MVPs. Three. Four. I mean, four-time MVP. Not too bad. Really not bad. Bishop is a 31-year-old running back. 
Like, um, uh, we're gonna get rid of a lot of people. If you're not under, like, 26, maybe even 27, I'm gonna get rid of you. Brian Ash. We might still get rid of you. I don't know, bro. I really don't. We even got some heavy hitters on defense, too. Dylan McLeod. You're only a 75 overall, though. But, I mean, you're still an X-Factor. You're not very good anymore, but... Still... Still something. I mean, I'll see your value is out there. Um, I'm going to make some trades. We're going to look at our pick situation. Okay, we have two fourths and two sevenths. Hmm, interesting. We have 16th. I want to check that if that's our own pick. Uh, that'll be good information to know. Okay, that is our own pick. All right. We're going to start on the defensive side of the ball because we know we just could get people like that. Leron Ruggs. Um, you're probably going to regress, which is the sucky part. I kind of want to keep you, though. Damn, this team is, like, really not good. Like, the age is so bad. Okay, we have something to work with with Dante Griffin. It's not a bad player right there. Really not a bad player. His zone fucking sucks, though. But he's speedy. Could get to the quarterback a little bit. Yeah, he he's somebody you want to build around. I like it. We'll start with you. Let's check our safeties. 27. I'll keep you. All right, find a team that has some green interest in these guys. Or at least yellow on two of them. I seen green and yellow from the Eagles. But do you have a good first round? You have the third pick. Potentially. And they're saying like no to that automatically. Ravens could take this. They have the seventh pick. Okay, what about the second round? All right, I overtraded for sure, but it's okay. It's okay, we're overtrading. Um, I think I'm gonna trade my quarterback to the Eagles. I think we need that first round for sure. We need that first round. Why do you have two quarterbacks? He hasn't even been getting playing time, and he has star depth. Jesus Christ, y'all. Yeah. We have another one. This game is so bad sometimes. Bucks have a first round. The number one overall pick. Straight up. I can do that. They're in our division too. No, they're not. They're in our conference. Thinking I'm still the Saints. Or I chose the Saints again. Trace some of our receiver depth. I like Brian Ash. I'm not going to lie to you. I really do. Speedy guy. Just can't really route run. Like his deep and spec and release even. It's not that good. How about a second and a third for them? <sighs> Y'all gonna do a second for sure. No? I don't even want to do this trade, which I ain't gonna want. What do I do this for a first? Wow, they really close though. Um, how about I add like a seventh in there? Should I be okay with that? We have so many draft picks this year. Let's add a six. No, you actually would not with that at all. I took that disrespectfully. A fourth next year. A third next year. I'm not too comfortable with that, but 
All right, they did it. Good trade. I mean, our team is getting worse, right? We're 77 overall now. It's beautiful. And we have a lot of picks. So we're going to do bad, so some of our own, some of theirs. I went to Dev Chart by accident. So we're going to trade away Josh Bray. I really want to keep Brian Ash. I don't know if I should, but I want to. Brian Nelson, right? This is a really good trade. But who's going to have a pick we could take, like a high pick? has to be like in the top five though. I was gonna say, I'll take like a top eight and then a second and maybe even a third. All right, y'all definitely gonna do this. I feel like y'all don't even need this. Uh -huh. Yeah, y'all need it. Damn it. All right, they're gonna do this. What? I get it, I get it, man. A fifth, I mean, a, a, you know what I was gonna say. Bro, they're right there. They want everybody. I just wish you could do more than fucking three sometimes, man. Bro, teams really wanna do this. And that's my asking price, so first and a second. A high first and then a second. All right, we did it with the 49ers. Cool. We have so many draft picks now. This is ridiculous. We're going to stick with your You're still 87, but you're a lineman. You're 30 years old. You're last. Um, I guess we'll trade away you. Keep you guys because you guys are fairly young. You are 33, but you are a superstar X Factor. I think we get a lot for you. I might even be able to get a first and a second, like I was trying to do before. Okay. I know what I can do. Maybe I get a second on this guy if I add that lineman. Not lineman, edge rusher. No. Can I get a fourth out of you? No. What about a fourth next year? I'll just do first. Just give me the first. Cool. I'm cool. Um, I think I traded away everybody I want to trade away. We can go back and check again, just to make sure everything is cool. So I have one, two, three, four, five, five first rounds. But I have so many draft picks in general. There's so many, beautiful. We are good to go. All right. Now you gotta advance week by week because we gotta answer these questions about relocating. That's what it is. I'm like, what do we gotta answer? Auto generate. We are really in twenty forty something. I don't remember what it was. First game of the season, we win somehow. How did we win that? Twenty to seventeen. I don't like that we won that. <laughs> Not good. Let the staff do all that scouting shit. Don't really give a fuck about it, honestly. Um, still no injuries about relocation, huh? Maybe in like week three we'll get it. Axel to choose a city. All right, we lose that in the last game, thirty-one to fourteen. That's all I like to see. Let's play it worse. Let's not even score a point next time. Huh? And we won that last game, so <laughs> how are we winning? We're bad. How are they 4 and all though? I mean, 0 and 4. Oh my god, I wish I could switch places with them, bro. We got a breakout player, too. Where do we want to move to? We already in Detroit. There's already a team in Chicago. There's already a team in our division in Chicago. 
Sacramento. That's pretty flawed. Columbus, Ohio. Joy team in Ohio. But there's not a Columbus team in Ohio. Let's go to Columbus. Not a lot of fan interest there, but they'll come along. All right, we're choosing our name. Not going to be Lions again. I don't think there's a Lion in Columbus or wherever we chose. I think we chose Columbus. Yeah, we did. Aviators. Yeah, because the first, um, I think the first airplane was made in Ohio. The Wright Brothers or the Flight Brothers, something like that. Caps? Capital? Columbus is the capital of Ohio? Interesting. I kind of like that one. Or Explorers. I think I want to go Caps. Caps look kind of cool. The low royalties. Aviators are kind of cool too. I'm going to go Aviators. I like Caps, but I think Aviators are... It's going to be something we want uh, our teams to like be built from as we keep on losing. I love it. I love to lose. I'm going to look at our uniforms. Not bad uniforms. I think I like these better. Like the no the stripes are kind of cool. I don't know. These stripes kind of look cool. I don't like these ones per se, but these ones look pretty decent. But people are interested in these way more. Style number three. I do like them too. Um, yeah, let's go style number three. This is going to be our body. We get to choose our stadium. Obviously going to be an open stadium. I think I'm choosing this one. All right. Um, so I said we're going to check our picks. Let's do that right now. Right now. Yeah, right now, come back, Junior. Right now. <laughs> That's a funny boost clip. Oh, man. All right, so we have the seventh, tenth, and a few of these picks like, eh, didn't go so good. To say the best, seven, ten, twenty, twenty-five, twenty-six. I'm not mad at these picks. By any means. I think I think they're good. Obviously, we don't know who's going to be in a draft. Um, yeah, we don't know. And we don't even know who's going to be a free agency. We have a lot of cap space. Do we have to re-sign players? Can I check our salary? Re-sign players. We almost have 100 mil in cap space. And these players don't even cost that much to re-sign. And I hope they wouldn't re-sign them to begin with. Yeah, like at most you're gonna cost twelve mil. That's not really much. Um, I'm gonna leave it as it is. I was gonna make some trades, but I'm like, nah, just leave it. Fuck it. Another breakout player. How you got a breakout player in a bye week? Well, after a bye week, like there's no way you make the playoffs though. I mean, there's a way, but let's not. Lose again? Oh my god, that was a bad loss. 56 to 10. That was a bad division loss. Let's take another bad division loss. Let's go. That wasn't bad, but it's we did lose for sure. I'm not trying to get more than five wins this season. I'm trying to be worse than the Vikings. And they started off 0 4. There we go. Bruh, it's like they're trying to match us. I don't like that. I'm not answering no more media questions. So, perfectly. And now, since we finished at a five... How did they... I don't even understand, bro. bro. Can I look at my picks now? I mean, it's the end of everything, basically. Look at our picks. So, we have the third overall pick. 17, 21, 24, and 29. Uh... It's decent. I mean, I still can make some trades, but it's very decent, I would say. 
um, I'm going to go to Franchise Settings, League Settings, and we're going to go back to how we usually want things. We want to do the practice reps, league advancements, uh, scout. Scout is always going to be auto. I don't really care about that. Negotiations, preseason cut days for that to me, management, free agent bidding, trades and free agency, and weekly training. Put that all up to me. That's crazy. Washington football team actually got in it. All right, we are officially the aviators now. That is a perfect way to cap it off. All right, I need to change the way I look. <laughs> I didn't want to look like that. No, I made a player. Why can't I change the way I look? Look at this aviator sweater. What a guy. I don't like his face. New coach. And now we're going to go to manage staff, franchise staff. New sign head coach, Kenny Jones. We'll change our schemes later in the beginning of the season. We'll do this later, actually. <laughs> I keep saying we'll do it now, but no, we'll really do it later. Moving on. First week of free agency. I think it's going to be our last chance to sign back a player. I just think it's so long to load though. I might have to get I thought I was gonna get kicked off. Honestly no. You guys are like sixties. I don't care about y'all. We have big money to spend. Like yeah, literally over a hundred mil we could spend. This was the quarterback for the Um Must say the Aviators. What are the Aviators? For the I can't remember the team. But it was a quarterback for somebody. We're not going to sign him. He's kind of old. Honestly, if you have some good speed, I might sign you. You have 94 speed. You don't have a lot of strength, but we don't need you to have strength like that. Um, I'll sign you for four. Boost that salary a little bit. How do you like that? He doesn't like that at all. <laughs> I'll just take my offer back. I don't want to pay you that much, though. He wants 20 over 5. I don't want to pay you that much. Not very good, but I would pay you some money to be on this team. About 14. Overpaying for a tight end? A little bit. A little bit. You're not even looking for a lot. You're only 25 too. I'll give you a three year. Twenty three. Giving you twenty three mail. Just try to get you for the base. I'm gonna give you a one year deal, unproven. And someone else is looking for to get on the team. Just handing out some measly deals. DT, we don't need anybody crazy right now. I think we could just survive with what we got. Right in. Kind of the same case. I would like some... A little bit more depth. Just leave it. Just handle some base deals to these people. Especially if they're not getting offered contracts. Why not? I like my linebacking core. Young. Um, right. You're going to need some help on that right side. But you guys are acting for a little bit more. Not that I'm not willing to give you this. I might give him like 10. Something around there. A little bit more. Give him 12. Three per year. He wants like 10 for two. Give you 9.98. All right, need a kicker. Sure, I really don't care, just a kicker. 
We spent money fairly well in this free agency. I think... I think I'm going to be willing to put money in a receiver. I don't necessarily want to pay you 10. I kind of only want you for two years. I'll be willing to do this. Someone that's young, a fair overall. Someone that could develop for us. And, yeah, we're going to see if we can sign these players, obviously. Moving on to week three of free agency, I believe it is. Free agency three, whatever the fuck they call it. And accepted, accepted, Titan rejected. But I think everybody else has accepted us, and I'm perfectly fine with that. And we're going to look at our team. And I'll tell you what I'm looking for in free agency. Not free agency, the draft. We're going to upgrade at point guard. Point guard. <laughs> Places we're looking to upgrade are uh, left guard for sure. Left guard is horrible on our team right now. Possibly right guard. Receiver. Um, maybe running back. Quarterback. Maybe edge. Maybe. That's about it. We're going to move on to the draft. I think I'm just taking too much time just simulating week by week now. And they kicked me off the servers. Uh, boy. This recording is very long. I've been doing this for like two hours now, bro. Doing this for two hours is insane, bro. Insanity. But I'm trying to get this video recorded. Then edit it up through the weekend. It is Friday right now. We are going to pause the draft. Just to see if we want to make any trades. We have the fourth pick. We actually moved up a little bit. Interesting. How did we move up like that? Can I look at my picks? 4th, 18th, 20th, 22nd, 23rd. Okay. I'm cool with those picks. I'm very cool with those. Is there anybody we want to take that we're scared that might drop? This quarterback is a top five draft pick. So he was decently fast. Run a 4, 6, 4. Not incredible speed. Man, his change of direction is really good. He has an A stiff arm. He might be a scrambling quarterback. He might really be a scrambling quarterback. That's incredible. But I think, oh man, uh, this quarterback class is very weak. Yeah, I think we're going to take this quarterback. But he's projected to go later. One to two. His skills are there, man. He could run. He could throw it deep. Um, all right. I might do that. But who's going to be that fourth pick for us? Not very fast. But he could jump. What was his height? 6'4". Big receiver, good carrying, break tackle. You might be a running back, bro. Desmond Scott. Hmm. Maybe. Can I not do that? Can you not add him to your board? Yeah, you're supposed to be able to favorite them, aren't you? I want to favorite this guy. You can't favorite them in here? That's so weird that you can't favorite. Whatever. There's even some good tight ends that's supposed to go pretty high. I mean, I could take a tight end with one of my picks. That would be kind of risky to do. But I've had drafted some good tight ends in the past. Like some really good tight ends. Oh my god. A catching traffic. A catching. 
a break tackle. I'm not going to lie. That's kind of beasty. I'm liking it. I'm really liking what I'm seeing. But, I mean, I have a lot of picks in, in that 20 range. So I'm not really too worried about if we... If some of these people drop. What I could do... I go to my coaching staff thing. Yeah, and I can buy things that make it easier to trade up. Which, I like that. Oh, well, we got player progression all the way up. That's crazy. They don't even have a lot of points, though, because we haven't played any games. So, technically, we really can't buy shit. I mean, we... St uh, I'm not going to lie. I might want to keep these guys. <laughs> they have everything all the way up. The only thing we don't have is, like, my own stuff the head coach which we kind of need don't we no we actually don't i mean i'm cool you don't need to do that they took the cornerback which is not a bad person to take wait we're number two i thought it said we were number four it literally says we're the fourth pick i low-key want to trade down I don't really trade down a lot, but I want to trade down now. I'm about to just take the player I'm going to take. Alright. Wait, what? Oh, no, he's still there. But do I take a lineman, bro? Or do I take a receiver? I'm taking this as a mid-round guy, though, but... Oh, my God. I can't do that. Even the tight end, too. They look so good, though. I can't take a tight end number four or number two, whatever it is. I feel like I could take a lineman that high, but then again, no. Not the ones I want. They're saying this lineman is going to be very good. Top five. I mean, all his qualities are great. Elite acceleration. Great agility. Great change of direction. Great jumping. Solid strength. He's going to be coming off the edge for us, too. All right, let's just look at other positions. He is in mind, the right end. We're keeping him in mind. We're going to take him. Marquise Belton. Welcome to the Aviators. How old are you? You're 23, 6'2". Welcome to the Aviators. You are hidden. You look pretty fast for alignment. Forgot that's damn near 260. You went to Utah State, too. Shout out Utah. Skip ahead to the next user pick, and I pick 19th. Um, just hope my guys are here. Hope my tight end is here. I think they are. Is my QB here? He is. I think I got, I got to take him now. When's my next pick? Okay, my pick is two. It's basically two picks away. I can do that. This is the guy I want. He is the fast one, right? Yeah. I'm going to take Marvin Wesse. Or Wise. I don't know. We're going to take him. He is normal, but it seems like, yeah, he has 90 speed. I'm not mad at that pick. I would wish he had head and hidden, but I'm not too mad at that pick. I'm going to skip to next because we do pick literally next. They don't take a middle linebacker. And I think I'm going to take my tight end here. I think that's what we're going to do. Our receiver, he's still here. He's not. But my tight ends, both of them are still here. They're both around the same uh, height. 
6'2", 274, 6'2", 242. That's 274. 274 is crazy. That's a big tight end. Um, based on the skills, I liked the second one a little more. Honestly. Cam Gibson. I liked his skill set a little more. And I think I'm going to take him. He just has better catching stats. Probably not better route running stats, but better catching for sure. He's also normal. 85 speed for a tight end is not too bad. Um, Yeah, he's pretty fast. And I don't know if anybody noticed this in the draft, but I took two 23-year-olds, which is not ideal for drafting. We're going to skip the next pick because I do pick next again. They are taking another cornerback. A lot of cornerbacks are going off the board when I'm, like, right after I'm picking, or right before I'm picking, per se. I think, I don't know. Do I take Lyman here? Desmond Scott. I don't know. What's my next couple picks? So this is my 22nd, and I have a 23rd, and I don't pick until the 2nd. But I have a couple, I have consecutive picks in the second. Is there any, like, definite first-round talents in here? I don't think there's going to be. Remember linebackers, like, a definite first-round talent? No. I'm just looking at bad players, bro. I low-key want to take that tight end again, but I think I'm going to take one of these linemen. I think I'm going to take Desmond Scott. I think that's my guy right here. Is it? I think one of them had like A something. Might have been you. Yeah, you're my guy. I'm gonna take Daniel Witt. Um, 88 strength is something to be happy about. Taking <laughs> the appropriate guys, I think, to um, better our team. And do we pick again? We do. Um, do we take back-to-back -back tight ends, basically? Just because, like, they're so good. I think I, I don't have to, but I think I am. This is a crazy pick, don't get me wrong. This is a wild pick. But, uh, do we have another pick after this? We actually don't. I'm going to take him. And he's... He's more agile for sure. Like, he can fucking fly. Oh, man. I mean... Even if I don't end up liking how his stats look, I can end up trading him. And he's going to have decent value. I'm going to guess he's like a 72-ish overall. We're going to see who's at the top of the board. I'm not going to go searching again. If you're at the top of the board, I just might take you. Uh, Aaron Foster. Let's go James Mendoza. Do we want to do that? I don't think so. Let's go cornerback Pat Hobbs out of NC State. Shout out to the NC boys, man. The uh, boys are Whoa. back in SKI <laughs> He's hidden. And he's very fast too. I'm not mad at that pick. Obviously you can't be when you draft a, a hidden dead. Do we want to take another cornerback? Nathan Jarrett? I think I do, honestly. I'm going to trust him. And another hidden dev. Not going to lie. Pretty good. Pretty fucking good. He's actually not. But you know who is here? Desmond Scott. Why is he here? You kind of suck. Desmond Scott, I'm going to draft you. And... Decent strength, acceleration cool, agility's pretty low, 
Did I? I just skip my pick. I just skip my pick. I don't even know who he just picked. I don't even know. Oh well. Dave Mendoza has dropped tremendously. We're in the fourth round? No, third round. And he's still here. I think I'm going to take him just because he dropped so damn far. What's our next pick, actually? Um, yeah, I think I'm going to take him just to see. And Hidden Dev. Hidden Dev, I mean... 622021 21 out of Idaho. 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 I said Idaho. <laughs> um, pretty decent. There was a lot of hidden devs in this draft. I really don't know who I should pick anymore. I think I'm going to trade these picks away. Now we're going to trade some picks away. I had like two force left, so I let that go. And I think now we're going to trade the picks away. Try to get the best value we can. I kind of wish it was like two fours, but most of them like a fourth and a seventh or just a fourth by itself. We'll do this one with the Broncos. Trade away another one. Just didn't. These trades don't really matter. They're not going to affect anything, really. Just going to give me more draft picks for next year. I think I'm just going to end <laughs> I'm just doing bullshit right now. I don't really know. Very tired right now. It's like probably one o'clock in the morning. And I'm drafting people. We'll see what the draft recap is looking like. All right. Marquise Belton. It's a 70 overall. Very good. I think we made the right choice. Finesse moves is at 80. Strength 86. Block shed 74. Just gonna have to get that power moves up. Um, I like what we got here with uh, Marquise Belton. Then we took a QB at 18. He is... The throw power is not there, which is gonna be a problem in early on. But he has a lot of speed. Throwing the run is good. It's going to be the medium and short pass that's really going to get it for Marvin Wise. I don't even know if that's his name. Cam Gibson, I think this is going to be uh, the star tight end. I think he's really going to have a good shot to really break this offense out. And be the face of the aviators. Once again, good. Just it's just a very good value pick. Something that we needed. Then you end up taking another tight end. He's actually a higher overall than the other guy. I already forgot his name. He has higher catching. I mean, if we run like a dual tight end set, it could be deadly. Especially if we have time to throw. It'd be very deadly. <laughs> then we dra draft Pat Hut. Pat, I was like Pat Hudges, Pat Hobbs, and I would say one of my best draft picks. Well, it's not really best, it's more surprising. Didn't think he'd be that good. Then we draft Nathan, and he was also very surprisingly decent. Very surprisingly decent. Desmond Scott was okay. Something to work with. We took Julius Blackman. I mean, Julius Jackman. Uh, decent. Speed receiver. They took another receiver. Oh, I took this one, actually. Surprisingly, he had hidden. And who knows? I mean, I mean, the way this team is set up now, we have something built for the future. Horrible pick. Decent pick right here at the right end. A very late one, too. Pretty decent. I thought it said Scotty Pippen, Brandon Pippen. Pretty decent. Like, our draft picks were pretty damn good. Not so good. I'm going to look at that. And a 61. Like I said, I'm cool with what we drafted. 
and how our team is looking. We're going to move on to, bro, what they got me doing right now? I'm trying to end this video. I'm just trying to look at the team, end the video. I'll fix everything up and whatever. I'm going to look at our team. Pretty decent now. Pretty damn decent. And it kicks me off. <laughs> this is a fucking joke. Oh my god, I've been recording for like really over two hours. This is insanity, bro. Alright, I just want to check my roster. Is that okay with y'all? Alright, look at the team. It doesn't look incredible on paper, but it is very decent on paper. Like, when you actually look at it, it's pretty decent. Pretty damn decent. We might make some trades, but I think our team is really good now. How did we get him? Was he always here? I don't remember him being here. <laughs> I don't know why. I really don't. I gotta go look. Yeah, he's always been here. Interesting. Um, I guess. I think our team is really good now. I think our team is at a really good spot. We're somewhere in the middle. Not actually fantastic, but we're pretty decent in terms of what you want to do. I might turn this team into... 3-4, maybe? I don't know. Maybe I want my linebackers rushing. Maybe I want them in coverage. Most likely, I'm going to have them rushing. But we do have a good edge rusher, so that's the thing. Like, right ends. We'll have to figure out something, though. Um, yeah, this is going to be the video. If you did enjoy, and you are excited for a new, brand new series, a very original series. Like, a very original. Like, I think I like this idea that I came up with. Uh, could use some tweaks, kinks, and work things out, but I like what we have here. Anyways, like I said, if you did enjoy, leave a like. It lets me know that you did enjoy the video, and if you want to see more videos, just like this. And when you do like it, it gets out to other people. And also subscribe if you are. Uh, if you want to see more videos like that, don't forget to tap that bell icon so you never miss a video. And you know every time I upload, go straight to your phone, get a notification. Looks nice, looks pretty. You might see a premiere here and there. This might be a premiere. Who knows? I don't. Um, but yeah. Like, subscribe. Let me know what you think. How you think the series is going to go on? What trades do you think we need to make? Do we even need to make any trades? I don't know. Anyways. That's going to do it for me. Peace. Job was out of the question. Young niggas learn how to chef it, learn how to stretch it. Shit real jerk in the pee. Stay in my Q, say whoop, pop up from three. Niggas ain't squashing the beat. Niggas ain't squashing the beat. Shit get dark in the pee. Stay in my Q, say whoop, pop up from three. Niggas ain't squashing the beat. Fuck, move, I do what I do in the block on the street.